Hey guys, so this video is going to be about my top favorite red lipsticks. In my previous videos, I've done a video on my favorite pink lipsticks and my favorite um, nude lipsticks. So I wanted to do my favorite red lipsticks. So I just have a few that I want to show you guys. And these are like my top favorite lipsticks that I do wear sometimes. I don't normally wear red lipsticks all the time because I my skin tone, I'm really white. And just, you know, on camera, I notice I look a lot darker, but I'm not. It's also because of the bronzer and the blush and, you know, the foundation, all this other stuff. And whenever I wear red lipsticks, I like now I found the perfect red lipstick that I want to show you guys. But I've been trying so many red lipsticks and I feel that this is a perfect time to wear dark colored lipsticks because, or lip gloss, you want to say that, because, it, you know, the, the holidays is coming up. The first lip product I want to talk about is the Maybelline Baby Lips. This is the lip balm and it's called Cherry Me and it smells so good and I'll swatch it for you. When you, when you put it on, it's pretty sheer. I don't know if you can see that. I like this lip balm. It makes my lips so moisturized and really soft. The next lip product is the Sugar Rose. And this one is the Tinted Lip Treatment in SPF 15. That's how it looks. And it, it's the same thing as the other lip balm from Maybelline. It's pretty sheer and um, it smells really good. And it smells like lemon. Like lemon... Yeah, like lemon. To me, it smells like lemon. The only problem with this is that when you apply this lip balm, you have to have it at least this high because what happens is it's so easy to break off that um, you're just going to lose a lot of product like that. The reason why I got a sample size is because um, when you go to Sephora, they give you like a free gift for your birthday and they gave me this one with, it came along with the other lip balm, which is pretty clear, but is in yellow and the packaging is like a, a burgundy color, I believe. And it, it's like a little small box. They also have the full size product, but um, I believe that's $20 at Sephora. I don't know where else you can get it at, maybe online. So I have two from e.l.f. and these are the studio lines and I've showed this in my previous lip product video. This one is the color Cheerful Cherry. This is more like a deep, deep red with like blue undertones and I'll swatch that for you. So this is the color and as you can see it's really, really dark, especially for my skin tone. But I believe that's good because you want a color that's gonna pop if you're really light skin like me. If you're gonna wear something neutral in your eyes and then you have this lipstick, it just makes your lip pop more. What I can say about this lipstick is that you don't need to put a lot of layers on just to get the exact color from the tube. It's just really easy to put on and I really like this color. Anything that has to do with blue undertones and a red lipstick or purple are like mostly my favorites. And this one is really like one of my favorites so far. And the other lipstick from e.l.f. is, is called Barely Bitten. And this is more of a lighter color of a red. And I like this one too. So that's the color right there. The color just, you know, comes on your lips really, really fast. And you don't have to add more and more product to get the exact color. Next lipstick that I like as well is from CoverGirl. And this is the Queen Collection. This is in the color 290 Burn Brûleur. And I really like this one too. So this is how the lipstick looks and it's pretty, it has like a sheen to it. It's not matte, it's not shimmery, but it has like a sheen to it. And it does have that, I don't know what type of smell it is, but um, CoverGirl always have like this smell with their product, like their lip products. And that's the color right there. And it's kind of like the other one from e.l.f. It's kind of like this one, but it's like a really, really deep red. 
and I like that I really like that a lot and I like the fact that when it comes to CoverGirl they have like this packaging where you can see the lip product the next lip gloss that I really like is from L'Oreal Paris and this is an infallible plumping lip gloss and um, they have one in different colors but this one to me it's like a really pure red and I really like that and you can wear this alone if you want to if you don't want to wear any lipsticks but this one it's like a straight red and this lasts up to six hours and that's that's pretty good for like throughout the day and you could just go back and reapply it if you want to and it's supposed to be plumping but I haven't really felt any of like that that feeling where it makes your lips plumpy but I'll give you a little swatch of the color and it smells so good oh my gosh like it's really really nice so that's the color right there and as you can see it's exactly the color from the tube and it smells really really good like I was just about to smell it but um, I really like this lip gloss and I'm not a big fan of lip gloss but this one is really really nice and it lasts for a long time it really does and it comes out straight pure red and I mean it would look really nice if you had a red lipstick and then you top it off with this one so you can get that nice shine but I don't really I'm not a big fan of lip glosses but this one it's something that I would wear because it just makes it last for a long time and it's not one of those lip gloss that just it gets sticky and you know it, it, get, it leaves like residue on the side of your lips and this one doesn't product that I really like a lot is from Essence and this is the triple L um, shine lip gloss this one's in the color 15 true love and I really like this one as well well I like all of the stuff that I showed you guys um, I don't even have room but I'm just gonna swatch it over here the only thing about this one is that it's pretty um, sheer as well and it's right here it's pretty sheer it gives you like a little tint of red and it's really nice it doesn't it's not really really sticky like some lip gloss are and the applicator is really different as well like the way they make their packaging is a lot different and it's pretty like it's not fully straight but it's like tilted upwards and you can purchase this at Ulta as well or online and it's really really affordable I really like this lip gloss and sometimes I'll reach for it if I want to add some red color or just some color to my lips if I don't want to just look washed out or anything like that so the next lipstick that I really really love and I feel like I found the perfect red lipstick and this is the L'Oreal um, color rich lipstick and this one is like I think it's like the new line because I didn't see this one back a few months ago but this is the new one and this is in the color 179 in cherry tulip and I love this one so that's the color right there and it's pretty sheer as you can see but it's very buildable and I'm gonna show you like it's really good see like that's the second layer and then that's the third layer it's very buildable and that's and it's really moisturizing as well and these lipsticks are really really great I like that L'Oreal is coming out with better products <laughs> I think this is what I'm gonna be using for now on or maybe as well I'm gonna use this for Christmas and my future tutorials because I love this lipstick and especially this color I'm gonna purchase more of their lipsticks because these are really good so that's all my favorite red lip products and I hope you really enjoyed this video I really like these red lipsticks and lip balms and lip gloss or whatever if you have any favorite red lip products that you really love then comment below and tell me which ones you like or that you really like from my video and what I showed you and yeah so that's it guys I hope you enjoyed this video and thumbs up if you really like this video and you want to see more lip product videos like different colors then I can do that as well and yeah so I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching bye